Hello and welcome to the Symbio video channel. In this video you're going to see how to define a attribute as a mandatory attribute. So that means the system will make sure that all of those attributes defined as mandatory will be maintained. Otherwise you, the system prevents you from initiating the release cycle. So let's just assume in the detail content the scope should be defined as a mandatory attribute. That means you simply go to the admin area of the database via the top right corner as before. Then you go to the extended configuration and then you choose the following type. Here it says when you scroll down a bit it says change and then make an attribute mandatory. So let's just go for that one. We give it a name. Let's just go for the scope. And as before in the detail content, you need to maintain certain data. So for which type it is valid, we just said it should be for a sub process. And then it should be the um, scope attribute. Here it is. So when this is maintained as before, we activate it and then we apply the changes via the functional bar. And as soon as is it saved? We go back to the sub process and the end product should be the following. In the detail content, the scope field should now have a orange frame and that's the case. So that means this is now a mandatory attribute and it needs to be maintained before initiating the release cycle. Attributes you do not define as mandatory are automatically optional attributes. Thank you for having watched the video.